turn this back on. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. I need a bub. Oh god. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Okay, I'm good. Illusions of the past. I just like drank like a whole cup of coffee. And yeah, that's that. That's that. It is 1:41 a.m. 26 of March 2024. Hello to anyone from the future. I hope uh, things is going well over there. But it's not going well. Actually, no. Life is good. Uh, I'm very excited for basically three more days. Three more days to my. I guess okay, we have. I am holding a celebratory birthday piece because birthday uh, the 28th is a public holiday in Malaysia. 29 is my actual birthday, and I am. What you call it? Uh, unfortunately, other my my friend are all either in internship or actually working already, so they are quite busy during that day. It's, to, it's on the weekday also, so it's like a uh, real unfortunate. But I'm happy that coincidentally the day before, um, it's free for everyone, and because of that be able to uh, prepare a plan for on that day and I am very grateful to my friend that they can able to help me plan out or flesh out the 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 activities we're gonna do on that day right I had idea I had uh, I, I know where or roughly what to do but my friend just help finalize everything else um, either whether or not we're actually gonna stick to the plan that's a whole different story but at least we have a plan it's better than not having a plan yeah I forgot to log in today's how your lab uh, check in also I forgot to mention last week or not last week uh, yeah last week actually um, my friend got his account hack multiple of his account hack his main i think it just basically his whole pc got hacked um my whole pc i mean just multiple launcher so he told me that his epic game store uh hoyovers um and like steam riot account all got uh hacked into other people account and uh for most part he able to like change the password or just reset it and whatnot for Hoyoverse or at least for because he only plays Star Real. Interestingly enough, he was logged into someone else's account. You know how during the set loading screen of like when you boot up Star Real, you see like oh welcome um, username I know username the like the the email address. They have the the email address that show up is not his, and it's someone completely uh, else. And he also received an email that's in Russian, um, at like four in the morning. So that's very eerie. Um, he can still play his game, so he actually now lost his like uh, login streak or login um, dailies. He can still play his account. But it's under someone else, um, someone else, uh, Hoyoverse account. Like his Star Real accounts in someone else Hoyoverse account, which is very wild to even imagine. So that's that. Uh, he contacted um, customer support for Hoyoverse and able to wrap up and get his account back within a week, which. It's kind of amazing actually the the fact that he even say to me like oh wow he did not expect the customer support to wrap this up so fast because we play enough game 
interact with enough customer support to know um, how long most of this kind of stuff will take but for Hoyoverse to just take one week hmm, I'm not sure it's either there's a common occurrence that they are facing so they're able to just dish out um, fixes that already uh, have been like, f uh, like basically have like a fix to already known problem I don't know if it's a known problem maybe they should fix it but hey I still don't know anyways uh, what's up with here we have new stages new fire type extension material new preservation new abundance okay let me my brain is not working right now so what is going on Okay, preservation and abundance, so this is obviously for the one other guy and the one other guy. Fire type ascension is for uh, Galanger. Um, wait, do we really, I already have lightning set? Wrong one. For Akron. Uh, ascension material. We do not. Wait, do Akron use what? Use this or this? Let me search up. Um, leveling calculator. This is a very useful app for Akron. Yep, calculate. You need the. Oh wow, you do need it. Huh. You do need this one to increase Akron, okay. So I guess I know what I'm farming for next. Interesting. I was I thought it's just gonna meet need another new material but okay. Oh shit I forgot my dailies. Fuck, I forgot one of my dailies. Oopsie daisy. Okay, hold on. I need to quickly do my dailies on other game. I, one of them has already skipped the day. Ah, shit. Today was... Um, I say it's uh, eventful because I need to plan out the, the plan for the activities. And... Um, I went to got, cut my hair. Ooh, this... I have to confess... Okay, this is something I need to get get off my chest. I am like absolutely terrified of uh, talking to stranger. Right, I have like severe and uh, social anxiety. But I can at least handle like a uh, necessary conversation, like point me the specific direction or order food and whatnot because I know those are short quick and it's like just not much in it's like I, I just gonna get the information and get out the painful part is where you have to maintain a certain area like you have to stay in a certain area for extended period of time with someone you don't know um, like performing stuff on you <laughs> that's a very weird statement to say that I it is so odd to have someone um, basically bubbling bubbling is that even a word um, cut your hair la. ah fuck you my wifi is not suitable for this shit okay I'm just gonna quickly farm some material for my characters But yeah, so this after I move, I move to a new place, and I have because I move a new place. Obviously, the old bubble shop where I went to was obviously not existing. Oh wow, Zizok Chick the third to the dear citizen of Panacone. This is a group message sent to everyone in the late emperor phone contact. The late emperor ruled 
in the land of dream for many years, governing with virtue and earning the love of people of, of the people. However, due to a recent a reason in the real world, she had no choice but to uh, abdicate the throne to me, having me fulfill her unrealized ambition. Uh, the Dizor Six Dynasty will bear witness over generation passing down its legacy and continue to watch over its people until the end of time. It is an urgent matter that requires help. Please do not bear it alone and contact me. Also, to facilitate my subject who has been unable to enter their dream due to various circumstances, I will establish an administrative office at the uh, Revelin Hotel in the real world. If there is an important matter to discuss, please leave your dream and seek, out, seek me out. Second Emperor of the Zizotic Empire, Zizotic the Third. It's kind of odd that that's how that works, but hey, cool. I guess that that and that side of the story. Where was I talking about my side of the story? Um, something about my bubble, right? Because I have a new bubble area. I do not know how to interact with the bubble. Like I do not know how to tell them to cut my hair. Like for the past entire life, um, it is my father that helped me tell the barber how to cut the hair. And because again, Malaysia is like uh, multilingual, even though our national language is Malay and we also learn English. Why am I trying to assess? I'm trying to assess this one. I am like. Sure, I assure you, most bubble, uh, the the those that is like the the cheap kind that is is how to say, uh, it's one of those cheap cheap bubble where you can easily find a store. They just go in, cut your hair for like fifteen bucks and leave. Um, that's the like the kind of bubble bubble I only went to, and those kind of bubble rarely understand English, so you have to like speak in like uh at best Malay. But the one I went to like today, not able to like, like barely understand bare minimum Malay, and it's like this is coming from my father, who uh able to speak Malay to him. It's not like me like stumbling my Malay word. My mal my father able to speak like a uh, good Malay enough, uh and tell him how to cut my hair, and he completely cut my hair in a whole different way. Like this the first time I ever had this hairstyle and now I now I'm very conscious about my hair and I don't know I feel weird <laughs> this also make me realize that man I need to learn how to speak and learn uh, like a good hairstyle that I can just tell or like showcase the barber and just have them immediately cut and not rely on my father. That's the thing. I need to not rely on my father because I still do not know how to contact the fucking bubble uh, on cutting hair. Anyways, hi Chadwick. What the fuck is your name, Chadwick? The elderly man in front of you gazed calmly at the city of dreams in the distance. Was this always you? Following his gaze, you see a puff of smoke billowing from the fictional horizon of the city, signaling yet another time of merriment for the dream chaser. The glamorous city of festivity sounds so distant that it feels like a world apart from the elderly man and you. He sits upright, like a statue. Even his breathing is hardly perceptible. You can't help holding your breath when staring at him. To your surprise, you realize that one does not have to breathe in the dreamscape. Oh! It's convenient. How are you doing, young nameless? I thought you were breathing your last. Damn. <laughs> damn, even I'm not like, damn, this is not even. This is horrible for being a fucking joke response. Holy damn. The army set his sight upon your left shoulder. A lot of things have slipped my mind, but I remember that symbol, the nameless, a uh, legendary bunch. It's been so long since I talked to someone. Far too long. My name is Chadwick. May I have yours? You know what? I 
is that is it really confidential if people like if you're like holding your badge out in your uniform uh people can just tell you're like the nameless so it's like do people need to hide during uh like need to hide their identity when how the fuck do I say this? Anyways, my brain is not going well today. What a special name! Thanks, I make it up completely. <laughs> I'm not sure I will explain how my name came to be, but hey, I used to be able to tell a person's origin from their name. But you, you're special. Ah, if I put my name like Joe or John. You're gonna say, wow, your name is so special. There's no person named John anywhere. <laughs> I can feel the surging vitality in you, even though the thick filter of the dreamscape. You can't stop. You spend every moment of your life going on an adventure, or more precisely, a trailblazing journey. I mean, that's technically our job, but okay. The energy you possess is inexhaustible. And it seemed to be constantly overflowing. It's more than uh, most being I know can take. The early man voice is palpable with excitement. The unknown about your intricates and intrigues. Uh, sorry, the unknown. The, <clears throat> the unknown about you intrigues me. It sort of intrigues and delight me. Both are emotions I haven't experienced for a long time. After all, I still know nothing about myself to this day. Thank you for being here. What is with everyone that have like fucking memory loss? <laughs> as much as I want to keep this conversation going, I'm afraid I can't as they are here. And what's with everyone? Expecting someone to murder them. But this is like, what? 4 out of 4? <laughs> of someone about to die? Or had die? Or could die? Definitely had die moment. Sorry for disturbing you, Dr. Chadwick. We have received word that you are being harassed by an unknown individual. We are here to help you evict the intruder. Are you looking for trouble? Intruder, do I have to remind you that this area is open to dream chaser? Is it not? I can walk here just fine. We have the authority to expel anyone who violates the family's rule from the dreamscape. Are you trying to pick a fight? Huh? Huh? I know how to one two punch. Please, Miora. I like this kid. Could you tell her off the or can you let her off the hook this time? Please do it for my sake. You know how I detest surveillance. Fine, Dr. Chavit, I'm doing this as a favor. Just this once. Go away, Jim Dream Chaser. Uh, don't ever go near Dr. Chavit again, or you'll suffer the cosaka suck 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 suck. Tick tock over here quickly. I cannot I can I can't mimic any voice. Why the fuck are you all over here? Take talk. There's something fishy about that old man. Why is he alone here? And why is he being supervised? It's bothering me. Take talk. Do you think I can beat that woman? <laughs> what? This this is dumb. Mainly because you kill like fucking what God before. I assume at some point you probably kill God. And now you're like, damn, just one measly, uh, what, maybe like a trained martial artist at best. Ah, no way. This, this could be a, a, a real dilemma whether I can beat, beat the fucker out of it or not. I'm like, you, you fucking like what? Like, Fan of Cocolia, uh, help defeat Fantilia, right? S uh, ward off something onto death. Like <laughs> now you're worrying. 
you, you can't even bait someone <laughs> on like a normal size fight. Violence isn't always the best solution. I can sense that the old man is missing something. Tick tock, walk up all guy. How about we hide and wait for the families uh, people to leave so that we can help him. It's time for my clockwork to do this trick. Wah, wah. Okay, bye. Have a nice day. What a patient's bunch they are. Hurry up and check on Warwick. Warwick? Fuck, there's too many wick that have wick on it. Also, this is not fucking ward off from public. Look at all those people. They can easily just stand here. How come you're still here? I really love to talk to you more, but you can't stay here for long. A double half family never give second warning. I'm gonna. Uh, fuck's sake. I gotta assume you are angry. Never mind. Constructing dreams is something sacred. Trash recyclable. Absorb energy emotion. I've been working on for it for months, now it's almost done and suddenly told me it's not thrilling enough but it's never mentioned that requirement before Stop, how do you handle it? What else can I do? I ha I made some change and presented the new design to him a few days later The one I showed you earlier and I got rejected again Why? Why is this good enough? Because it was not romantic enough What the hell? Ridiculous right? What will happen next? I consider his requirement comprehensively and holistically and spent another week coming up with a new version it's the spider path garden, right? It's an awesome design. And then it got rejected again. Eh? Well, he hesitated for a long time and finally said, maybe let's just use the initial plan. Oh, thank you. Okay, time to slot this in to use a slotting slot slot. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Whack. Hmm. Now I'm angry. <laughs> Without a doubt, the clockwork is successful. However, chat with expression remains unchanged. Yet you can't discern an underlying change taking place beneath the surface. Years of experience have taught the elderly man to conceal his emotion, but he can't stop his body from trembling in uncontainable joy and anger. This is one of the oddest, uh, like, I guess what, ethical dilemma I'm thinking of. Like, they're actually spending their life in, like, this world like this dream world and people are actually like you know have a life here but it's all like not real to a certain extent I guess the experience is technically still real it's not like it's in a simulation where everything you meet is fake the people you meet here is real it's just that the material doesn't exist elsewhere right so I guess technically everything you do normally at home can be do here and you experience the same nonetheless. Um, the reason why I say this is that he what is it called? This guy lost like lost his like one one part of his emotion in here. Right? Does that mean he lost his emotion in real life too? Or is it only when he logged into here that only he lost his emotion? Oh, this is like a whole lot of like, huh? Moment, right? Maybe if I understand how the dreamscape work better, uh, dreamscape, dream, dream, whatever, dream, dream, uh, I can like piece together more easier uh, like timeline or like not timeline it's like easier theory but for now it's like it's kind of odd you're just here you know if you're like a very high maintenance or very high individual like high honor indi individual wouldn't you just need to be like guarded in real life instead of like here um, I don't know Maybe, maybe he's not even real in the first place 
You guys can decide under the ancient thing. You always really have taught the elderly man to consider his emotion, but he can't stop his body from trembling and a convoy of joy and anger. My memory seems to be coming back. Things are coming out in a search. I guess that's what uh, why most people forget during the quest. It's just that we have to find the goddamn memory for them. The memory are fragmented and incomplete, but I can see them. The elderly man limbs stopped shaking in a furry. He shut his eye, trying to trace back everything in his life. Countless scattered fragments flashed before me. I tried to catch them all with a net, but they keep slipping through the mesh slightly and vanish into the ocean of unconsciousness. Only a few fragments are caught by the mesh and stay in the net. I have to pick them up cautiously. I saw something. It looked like a type of weapon which brought about endless slaughter and death. I seem to be related to it. Why? I don't see myself as someone who finds pleasure in violence. That's a dread dreadful thought. Why else do you remember? Maybe you were once caught up in the war. I mean a lot of things, so just pry them up. I also saw some people. Oh, those extraordinary character. Even in fragmented memory, they can shine. I, I used to be one of them. I am, the genius society. I remember. Sorry, I finally remember. I was once a member of the genius society. <laughs> you might need help. Oh, <laughs> it's like why the fuck you mean by you might need help? It's like oh shit, you're with Hota. Fuck. <laughs> Ah, not again! Wait, is it though? I actually remember. I know, I only remember like Polka, like Polka dot someone. Like, it's like the only like other um, genius society that I can remember. It's like Polka something. I, I know they mention a lot of time other people, but I just cannot remember them. Because they have no face, <laughs> so that was the point of fucking remembering them. I think one of them just straight up re erased their entire face. <laughs> I concur. I've been stuck in this meaningless dreamscape for too long. Why would I, uh, why would I wow my time away without the slightest thought of rescuing myself? Could it be? What the fuck? I didn't know you can use wow like that. Why would I wow my time away? Huh. I'm not sure that's a mistake or that's actually how English are meant to be, but that's neat. Chadwick furrows his brow as he glances at the spot where the blood blow bloodhound family member walked past earlier. The family, this must have done something to me that left me powerless to fight back. I can't free myself on my own. Some sort of powerful external force has to intervene, like like the genius society. I want to know a few of his member. Will you be willing to lend a hand to an elderly man you barely knew? That you are confined by the fairy borders me. Yeah, that's barely it. I see, you're driven by your sense of justice. Ah! I don't know if justice is correct. I, I do trust the Bloodhound family. But... You are kind of sus, like why is the Bloodhouse family do Anga in you? Mm -hmm. And it's more like curiosity that I'm like guarding you for now so that you can spill the bean. But yeah, sure, I'll try justice. Thank you. The dream is beautiful yet unreal. If I keep staying here, I won't be able to res rescue myself. You have brought me a glimmer of hope. I guess that's answer my previous question. That's more than enough. You should go before the Bloodhound family are back. I'll be waiting for your return with hope. Hope. Chadwick from the Jesus Society. I haven't heard from him before. Let's text Herta and ask her about it. Hello, Dolly Doll. I want to ask you something. Do you know someone called Chadwick? That's pretty common name. There must be a tens of billion of Chadwick across the universe. Can you be more specific? 
Uh, yes. So it was a member of the Genius Society. Question mark, question mark, question mark. You think I have time to waste joke around with you? You're joking, aren't you? But I, I, I'm not joking. <laughs> so you're serious. Come back to the space station ASAP. Oh, and keep your lips sealed about this. Do not go babbling about this to anyone. I'm not joking either. Oh wow, you're such a yes. jest. Um, Mr. No, Mrs. A fucking um, Madam Herta. Go, cool, we're gonna go all the way back to the Herta space station. Go meet up with. Go meet up with. Go meet up. Go meet up. Should be somewhere here. I don't actually see the the icon. Wonder where I need it this time. Imagine it's actually not that somewhere here. Herta's office. Oh, it is. For some reason, I thought you only go there if you want to do like simulated universe related content. I mean, there's one fucking Hota right here. Hi, Hota. Goodbye, Hota. I'll see you soon, Hota. Yep, 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 yep. Bam. Oh. Oh, wow. Is that straw box? Is that Chadwick? No way, fuck! <laughs> that was time. How come Shock Scrollum is here? I, wait, I think I pronounced your name wrong. Or say your name wrong. Anyway, Scrollum. It's been a while, Madam uh, Yarodos. I hope life is treating you well. There's no time for a pleasant read. Now, screw Lee. Screw V! Groovy. That's the that's the name. Let's cut to the chase. There's no rush, Hata. Assumption: If Chadwick has been stuck in Pentagon for tens of thousands of system hour, I think we can afford a couple of minutes to discuss this issue. You can act all righteous as you want, but I can no longer wait. The thing he is keeping are too valuable. So are you saying that Chadwick was right? He was indeed a member of the Genius Society back then. The man is a real deal. Um, I mean, his research is very valuable. Uh, Calderon Chadwick, Junior Society number seventy-nine. His expertise includes solid-state physics, applied theory of imaginary numbers, and ballistic. His seat is higher than yours. Oh shit! Our seat do not influence our statutes. You're not going to be able to round me up with that. I've been traveling across the universe since the flame of life was ignited in my core. Uh, throughout the long, that's that's one way to say that you're just fucking born. <laughs> uh, the, throughout the long journey, I rarely met so that described uh, that truly deserve to be called genius. Venom is one of them, and so is Calderon Chadwick. Thank you for throwing in a compliment for me. Wow, so cool. Wow. I met Dr. Chadwick twice. Our first encounter happened when he was still young and ambitious. And the second time decade I was decade later, the situation in both meetings were starkly different. Recollection. Dr. Chadwick once asked for my help. It was about fifty at the time. I agreed uh, to help him at that time. Ever since I have never heard from him again. It was as if, it's, as if he had never existed in the universe at all. How do Madam Hoda receive your text? You assume like I don't know. You will check like one of the most will be sitter spot in like galaxy 
on their whereabout you assume uh, that they could just be there right you know like it could be worse right it could be like in an unknown planet far far away but no this guy is literally just chilling in a fucking pub and you guys tell me no one saw him or not reported you guys are genius society that can't even think of a way to find other people I'm sorry <laughs> but okay the family who know what kind of scheme they are brewing screw it what do you think uh, we should do there are too many uncertainties surrounding this matter. For now, I am unable to come up with a convincing solution based on the limited information. Hypothesis, Dr. Cherry offered the family for some reason and... Sorry, offended the family for some reason and was confined in the dreamscape as a result. Things still don't quite add up in this scenario. As far as I know, uh, Calderon Chadwick is not long life species. It could have been decades since I was last in touch with him. Because he's in a dream, his real world body is like Okay, missing or something Rotted away or something Alright, there's only one way to uh, unravel the mystery I'd like to travel to Panacone myself And find a chance to visit Dr. Chadwick Madam Yarados, would you like to join me? Is it that fast to just go in and out of a fucking planet? I mean, uh, yup Basically, planet. Hmm. Well, sure. Likewise. There is something I have to tell you before we go, Madam Yarados. The most outstanding achievement of uh, Childeran Chadwick's life is the invention of a weapon called Imaginary Impulsion Pulse. The weapon took millions of lives and destroyed countless homes. Hmm, sounds like someone I know. Oh, that's it. That's literally all you have to say. Just, oh, he could invent one and that's it. You guys are staring at this guy. This is not even Chadwick. I thought this guy is Chadwick. I'm like, oh no, it's Chadwick. No, it's not fucking Chadwick. It's just a fucking Elson or something. What's your name again? El Elias. Got them, Elias. Ruin other people's plan. Wonder where I needed this time. Wonder where I needed this time. Hello. Uh, even if we stood on each other's head. Wrong button. You're finally here again, Madam Yarados. You're so efficient. Wow. I must praise the miracle brought to this universe by the Trailblaze. It's been quite a long time since I came, uh, last come here. The lobby of the Ravine is still as extravagant as I remember. What? How the fuck does a robot go to the dreamscape then? Do they? Do robot even dream? Oh god, we are getting more philosophical as we go on. Let's head to the reception and ask about Chadwick whereabout. I always regarded dreams with awe, but I rarely frequent Pentagon the planet of festivity. To me, the so-called sweet dream are often uh, saturine and insincere, a stark contrast to the true shape of the dream. I wonder after emerging, I can't even read on time. The fuck is that? Welcome to Penoconi, Miss Yarados. How can I help you? I see you brought a friend today. <laughs> Okay. My name is Scrollum, madam. Please forgive me for coming here uninvited and without checking it. You should be able to see my name uh, on the permanent VIP list of the family. Wow! That's crazy! Uh, Elifis twitched slightly upon hearing the name of Scrollum, but she is quick to compose herself. You really uh, uh, admire her professionalism. Just a moment, uh, Mr. Scrullum. Your name is indeed on the permanent VIP list. Welcome back to the Panacolic Scrullum. What can I do for you? That Twitch is like what? 
it's like how someone like suddenly met up with Albert Einstein or something. It's like, oh wow, this guy is smart or something. <laughs> I guess that's true. If I had to meet like what? I don't even know who is smart in this day and age. I'm not gonna continue with that. Jarodos and I here ha uh, are here to visit a hotel guest here. Dr. Sharon Chadwick, could you arrange for us to meet? For what I know, he's been staying here for quite some time. Sharon Chadwick, that doesn't that name doesn't ring a bell. Uh, which is strange. Please bear with me while I check the system data. That won't be necessary, Ali. I'm sorry, gentlemen. Dr. Chadwick can't meet with the whisper at the moment. What if he insists on seeing him? Ah, huh? Moira. Oh, very good name. I do like Moira as a name. Count yourself lucky that Mr. Shroom is with you, Dream Chaser. Otherwise, let's not escalate the situation. The family wouldn't want to disturb the guests in the lobby. Right? No, they definitely would. To the best of my knowledge, Catherine Chadwick is a long life species. And last time I talked to him, what? Two Ember eras ago. I'm gonna assume that is long. By what means to did the family extend the lifespan of Karen Chadwick? Has that mean uh, by been been approved by the international health organization? Does it comply with the regulation of Panacone? I don't have the authority to answer your question or allow an authorized visit to Dr. Chadwick, sir. Please leave. This is no room for negotiation here. I know so your actions speak of your loyalty to the family. Well, can I assume that you'd rather turn the family against Baroness Crowleum just to uphold your principle? Am I correct? You have a planet just all by yourself? Huh. Are you prepared to bear the consequences of being the enemy of a genius society? So intimidating. Imitate in yeah, intimidating. Please excuse me for a moment. I need to consult my family ahead. It's gonna farm out when she returned her face as well has softened a great deal. A sincere apology for the inconvenience. The family has been Sorry. The family had instructed me to let Mrs. Scrollum and this nameless lady hear through. Please come with me. Um, where? Oh my god, I need to go all the way up there. Um, I think normally you need to go to elevator and whatnot, but can I just? I can. Wait, look at that. The power of teleportation. Magic and amazingness. Oh, amazing. Nice. One peach soul nice. Uh, where's Hiriko? That's the rest of the gang. E either way, they should be like here, out and about. Oh, I know. I know. This is my room. Because this is where we get kidnapped. But I guess Doctor Chevy. Didn't we came to this room before? Wait, isn't this room also... Fucking hell, what's his name? The... Um, the first quest we did. Uh, what's his name? What's his name? What's his name? Cannot remember his name, it's been so long ago. Um, yeah, he's like, his room is here, right? That's somewhere here. But I think that's in the dreamscape world. I think I don't know. Sure, oh well. This is Doctor Chadwick's room. The regulation prohibit the bloodhound from entering the hotel room without the guest permission, so I'll stay outside. A stricken regulation. Here, hey. The regulation is set by the family, uh, by the head of our family. I'm afraid Dr. Chadwick can't answer the door in this current state. Let's me open it. Come in. Dr. Chadwick, sorry for showing up here. So that we hope to my son's unexpected meeting. After you. 
Madam Yarados. Did he die or something? Ooh, I think he's dead. Uh, enjoy. So, what's up? He dead? And this dingy stuffy room, the only thing that remain of uh, remain remind you of, of long time is the pulsing hovering liquid bubble in the dream pool. But they won't be able to tell you where Professor Chakwit went. Uh, it went somewhere. I don't need him in the bath to in order to fucking you know dream Oh shit I dropped my mouse. You weigh a dusty suitcase with your hand. It's obviously empty. Uh, it may have left untouched. It may have been left untouched in this room for centuries. Fireplace. The fireplace heating is turned on. Yet the whole room is chilly, like a icy cavern. Can not imagine a normal person living in this place so cold? I think I know where Chadwick is. Oh my god. Come and take a look. Is it that house plant? Bum bum bum. The secret is right in front of us. Reach his body slowly into a dream pool. Gently, he scooped out a translucent bubble from the liquid. The moment the bubble leaves the surface, uh, liquid it starts flowing upward. Until it hover ring in mid air. At last, we meet again, Doctor Charing Chadwick. Is this Barbara Chadwick? Deduction: The likelihood of Charon Chadwick as a short life species remaining alive in this day in a corporeal state is close to zero. As of now, no long longevity technology has been able to extend the natural lifespan or of a normal human by two ember errors. On the other hand, the family Pelicani has a deep understanding of memoria and its related technology. Even though they can't sustain Chadwick's body, they could still extract the substance from the depths of his brain, allowing his consciousness to survive. Yeah, can you even consider to be alive if that's all you have? It depends on how you define alive, many in a galaxy of that uh, opine that machine, uh, which are made of cold metallic clutches uh, and ve a vein by electric circuit cannot be seen as a life form. One question remains. Why would the family go to such land to store Chadwick's memory here? What significance does his memory hold? A weapon you mentioned? I don't think the family is capable of extracting any useful information from Chadwick's mind. But you it's because Chadwick hesitant and trails off after the sentence. Let's talk about this elsewhere, in case someone is listening in our conversation. Do not have excellent hearing. You have the right to learn the story in its entirety, Madam Yarados. If you hadn't informed Madam Hota of your discovery out of kindness, I cannot be said how long Chadwick would be have been confined here. So I need a favor for you, uh, from you, Madam Yarados. I'd like you to pass something over to, over to Dr. Chad, Chad, Charis Chadwick for me in a dream. I believe that will help him come to his senses. I will negotiate with the upper echelons of the family towards the aim of taking Charis Chadwick's uh, memories bubble with me. And then I hope you'll find the full story of Chadwick, including matter that happened before he went missing. Have you have a nice dream? May have you have a nice dream, Madam Yarodos. Didn't, didn't we use this on the one lady quest? I cannot remember the name. Yeah, I cannot remember the name. Oh well. Go be now. I need to go in again and meet up with chat with again. Uh, sorry. Oh my god. My whole body hurts so bad. Okay. 
much better. My man is just out here staring to the sun. I'm not gonna miss this opportunity to take a photo. Uh, wow, what a photo! Cool. Hi. The elderly man in front of you gazed calmly at the city of dream in the distance. Oh yes, I'm glad I can still recognize you. I still remember the elderly man a bit voice when you were two part away last time. That tiny flickering flame of hope in his eyes seems to have been snuffed out again. I'm happy you're willing to talk to me. But you shouldn't just come here. Myra and the rest of the Bloodhound, for that matter, would, won't be pleased to see you. Yeah. Do you mean yes? I murdered them. <laughs> I I probably don't need to know the detail. I heard a story about the nameless. I believe you must be as talented as those in the story. You remember Scrollum? Scrollum? Screwy. As if it's struck by lightning, Scrollum's eyes slowly widen and strike or quickly contract again. The gloom how covering his eye dissipate, and his appear bright eyed. Scrollum. Where is he? He promised he would help me. Wait, no. He did fulfill his promise and he did fail me. He di and he didn't fail me. I was the one who went missing. Both my ears and mouth were covered. And I was blindfolded. Why? Why is everything such a chaotic, orderly, uh, disorderly member? I remember I'm a member of the Genius Society. But what did I do? And what have I forgotten? Who bound me to this illusory uh, world? Show the bottle of piss. Sorry. <laughs> Ready? Show the bottle of piss. The bottle of pure to Chadwick. Is this a bottle of piss? <laughs> pure. You have your recovery of memories. Got it. This scroll screws idea, right? Now, my. Chest feel like it holds the entire universe in it. I can see its flicker and feel its pulse, but I know nothing about it. But when you showed me the bottle of pill earlier, I a voice came from a distant corner in, on my of my universe. It tried to persuade you to trust Grom and you. Chadwick face beamed with uh, a smile. It's the first time you ever seen a January join in his life. Who am I to be picking now? Right, I'll take it. Let me help. He'll never recover ever again. He's gone. Okay. Oh shit, they go in. He's a gonzo. General Gonzo Zozo. Huh. I guess this makes sense as a location. The young cauldron Chadwick is standing right before you. It's where the same comprehensive experience even after several Emperor's era. Is this the post? Yes, Dr. Chadwick. Starting from here, we the technology department and your team will shape the future of the galaxy together. Uh, I don't know. I don't sorry. I don't don't be overconfident, Dotly. I'm not fully certain that this project will work out. Take it easy. What we need is you on our team, not a hundred percent success rate. Honestly speaking, but I've been representative about this. What do you uh, sorry, what you guys are seeking is a weapon that only exists theoretically. It could even Could even use as a universe, like, uh, what I call, uh, up evil in the galaxy. Of course, Doctor Chad don't ever and and underestimate the technology department. We might be geniuses like you, but we are plenty visionary. Uh, the Amber Lord, why swung their. Sorry, swung their hammer announcing the beginning of a new era 
It means that the legendary cosmic catastrophe is closing close. No explanation needed. I read the bio, the sorry, the brief history of the universe to know enough. By the way, I'm surprised you a uh, supporter of the catastrophic theory. I not the tree is just supported by theory. Communicable very good. It sounds like it's something you'll say. It's something you can't deny. Since the cancer of all worlds started spreading, the legion and the annihilation gain has become more and more active. Our mission here is to prepare and warn off those threats. I don't want to say things like uh, we are working for the just cause because I know you aren't that naive. Chat, uh, I think that our life can be a lot easier if we don't complicate it stuff. Yeah. I don't want to spend all day delving into this subject with you. Let's go down. What? Okay, I can already read that. Forgive me, but I cannot tell you where I'm playing from. Um, I hope you understand. Cool, I totally understand. Uh, if I this position, I want to know the location right here. It's not that bad. Do you laugh out loud instead of fire fielding a response? Of course, he know that it was a genius who stand before him. Are those true sting? You're right, but I think they are probably from the Black Swan era. It's been a long while since anyone stepped foot here. I won't be surprised by anything I see in his faces. I rest you guys managed to find this place. This is the first time I ever see it living through spring. Uh, it's a uh, pretty you un uh, Let's clear the space up and we can start cleaning. Converge and awaken. You me? Can you find the answer? Ladies and gentlemen, the space station beyond this door is where we concoct the miracle. Is Dr. Chadwick inside? I never thought that I'll end up walking alongside that genius. Uh, please hold your horses. Before you all officially become Dr. Chadwick's colleague, there's something I will I want to refrain from you. Uh, by walking through this bar, you'll be selected different life of your... We're selecting a different life for yourself. This step will be your life for a very long time to come. Your work, research, have fun and make friends here. You will work, research, have fun and make friends here. Actually, from the basic world until the project is launched or failed. Uh, if you aren't ready for this kind of life, you may uh, go. Call, you may go before I open this door. I've been studying imaginary theory since the age of 15. Work King with Dr. Chadwick is my long time ambitious. And this is an opportunity could uh, others could only dream of. The door is nothing. As scientists, we are long dedicated our life to chance. Your guys are just like him. I wanted to believe in the dude. Um, sorry, I wonder you. Sorry. What? You guys are just like him. I believe you will have a great time working with Dr. Chadwick. Well, ladies and gentlemen, please come with me. I can shake the world right here. Crazy, they're shaking.
the 37 destination test unsuccessful. The energy away from the collision failed to tear up the imaginary tissue. Uh, next tissue. Sorry. Uh, the energy away from the tissue. Why? Why you must? Sorry. Lift the safety protocol. Increase the collision rate to 1.3 times the default. Uh, threshold, let's take it from here. But this is too risky and might even comprehend the research safety. Exactly, we can try one more time. There's no need to. We'll try too many times. It's clear that we don't make any progress if we go down the same hill as them. Sorry. Go down the same road. Over the past three years, we overcome nearly every theoretical hurdle. The scientific achievements born in this lab are enough to leave the universe uh, amazed. But if we fail to build the imaginary pulsation, uh, imaginary implosion pulse, our effort will be in vain. The IBC won't allow us to take the specific result with us, not even a single word. As a scientist, we must succeed. We must succeed. Ah, we must see. Hey. My team and I have honored to have you here to ch uh, watch the detonation test. The lab isn't welcome visitor, but your special doctor please have a specialty. Uh, sorry. The technology department will want to treat you in a cool place. You're welcome, Dr. Chadwick. I'm flooded. I'm floored by you and your colleague achievement. Please allow me to explain your question. As courtesy sometimes compels me to ignore the decorum, just like what organic life experience. Why do you agree to take part in this uh de in the development of weapon as destructive ex destructive and as the imaginary impulsion pulse? Dolly, my friend from the technology department say that the weapon could be used to contain a certain destruction pulse. He say that we are going to we're gonna be doing alright. I'm sorry I'm very sorry, Dollar Shall we? I should not uh, have thrown that concentration on you um yeah, on you and Put you in position to give you an insincere question. <coughs> Sorry. I think we are all free to choose the life we prefer. Uh, we can put aside the reluctance uh, through the dis uh, though they that distract us and focus on our task at hand and ex area expertise. But you must be cautious, doctor. Uh, for people like us, even a major sit up sl slip up. Uh, can impact the entire universe. Our wisdom is both blessing and a burden. Some advice is too late to be given now. Now, let's get ready for the box containing a media. I hope you safeguard it and make sure it won't be able to open, uh, own, open by some ignorant kids. Uh, thanks for the advice, Dr. Shredder. I hope I can see you one day. No generation. I see. Only you can put on all this. After we located the IPC. Let's go with the appliance. Take him to control. I'm going to fight the director. Oh, I didn't know it. you guys are actually a target. Nightmare finally come. I'm very really sorry to tell you this, Chad. You might be a genius in your field, but you know nothing about power. Your knife built you from seeing the big picture, and you don't even understand the error you're in. 
you should have realized long ago that we are both merely pawn in the argue, a game of chess. Once you're placed on the bottom chessboard, we're no longer in need of your control. Weapon are made to uh, are made to make sorry are made to eliminate enemies. Is it hard to understand? Over there, a dozen vocal point of a legion are preparing to attack the joint route. Their present can lead threaten peer point safety. Our emergency are closing in. This is the perfect time to test the power of the imaginary emotion pause. You have a hundred, no, a thousand other ways to stop that car incur lower cost and effect fuel in the set. I got it. Finally, uh, what we have done here for the past 20 years is experience the result of our work through never truly be first. Stop lying to yourself, Chad. You know uh, what you were getting into right from the beginning, but you choose to ignore it. Come here, bomb maker. It's time to show the Legion our might. Sorry, what? A bond maker or something? The end of my creation. Uh, realistic projectile, unpredictable scenario. Now you were saying. Sorry. What was I saying? Ballistic strategy pre calculation is complete. Margin of error plus minus 0.08%. Charging Dilation Platform 60, 70, 85 complete. Roving Collider Status. Automatic Cruise AI uh, pro Deploy Enemy Contact Dilation. Uh, imagine Impulsion. Imaginary Impulsion Pulse Preparation complete. Ready to the any point. How many collector target they are in the best loss range? Okay, in the process, they estimate 24 planet at the same at the satellite level or above with the 100 range um, three, sec three secondary planet will with civilization of grade D or below hmm. the amount of uh, collector damage is unacceptable the detonation plan can proceed as scheduled it's time uh, bomb maker hit the detonation button Okay. The initial command confirm. Co collider charging in progress. 20, 50, 75. Threshold reach. Automation cruise AI activated. Locking target. Uh, lock up. Uh, lock on AI activated. Warming up. Changing chamber temperature has reached threshold. Imagery impulse is about to launch. 5. Dude, I. 4. Don't hold it against me, chat. We have to be responsible for our choice. 3. My name will forever be cursed. Yeah, what's the point? Uh, what's the price you have to pay, Dali? Look, this is your problem. You always take your gift and, and talent for granted, and you have no idea there are people like me. No one will remember us. Zero. Oh my god, I just died. Dear Lord. What I just experienced, was that the first half of a chat with life? But this memory isn't over yet. let's take a look at what happened to him later, after. Can I? Thank you. This thing still keep going eh? Oh, it's this kind of stum, dumb, dumb, dummy, dumb, dumb. Oh, your rest is you again. Now you have experienced my half, uh, half of my life and learn about my story. Do you, did, did the emotion hurry kill? A number that I try my best every day to forget. Ever since that day, I haven't dared to look in the mirror even once. I'm wor worried I might see a monster, a murderer who had killed countless people and ruined even more life. The day in the control room was the, uh, that day in the control room was the last I saw the bleep. Perhaps it was true that the power. That pawn don't deserve to be mentioned, just like how he put it. After that, I disbanded the team and left the lab. I managed to take some crucial data with me to keep them from failing into the wrong hand. I later learned from others that the higher up technology department who ordered the imagery 
emotion post nation was subjected to an internal review. They were never heard of again. Okay. But I knew the IPC wouldn't let the matter rest. The result of our research was way too valuable. Though they released a statement condemning the donation, they would never really give up the technology related to it. They needed me to correct the, the knowledge and keep it out of the reach of other fractions across the universe so they would be breathing down my neck. So I decided to escape, not wanting to live the rest of my life being controlled by other people. A name caused to my come to my mind when I needed help the most. We only made once, but uh, he saw through my hypocrisy and excuses. Yes, I made up my mind to look for him, uh, thinking that he could help me rebel against the IPC. This is the story of that little part of my life. Sorry, I just there's just so much going on. I cannot. I cannot. My brain is. Uh, my brain is fried. Normally, when they reach the climax, I can pick up what's going on, but. I cannot, like, for the love of me, try to understand what's going on. I'm just gonna assume we just go move by piece to piece. Okay, so I need to go there again. Once upon a time, there was uh, no interaction between Matters world. Sorry, different world. Some regions were already in possession of weapons powerful enough to destroy themselves. Out of the field for power, they established complicated laws and regulatory in an attempt to prevent this self unmaking device from falling into the hand of the insane or the violent. When the series C data become interconnected by the wider route, the exchange of energy and resources begin. New weapons, many times more powerful than the original one, emerge one after another. Uh, Bewilderingly, those complicated rules in the place to limit the abuse of weapons become increasingly simplified as more and more powerful weapons were invented. Uh, people who were torn because uh, torn of weapons when they are used to fight against enemy. I said there was a faraway planet where its people were being ravaged by ferocious flame. Uh, with their cries echoing throughout the sky. Yet for you and I, lying beneath the tree and gazing at the sky, the planet would be just another star plucked by another from many other. If, if every fucking one of them have like fucking uh, quest related to them, I'm gonna lose my mind. So how is that a third piece? That's the first one we literally see. Uh, how is that a fuck is that? How, how is that a third piece? Wisdom, what are, what's a perplexing word? Some see it as a matter of every problem and the ultimate of all virtues. However, many of those with extraordinary intellect are troubled by a spectacular problem. Is it because the genius are too arrogant? Or is it because jealousy get the better of the mundane? No one has an answer for that. Only one thing is irrefutable. Wisdom can coexist with selfish desire. Oh. the button to a shortcut. Guess I'll take this. What did Zanza see when he was recorded tomb of the imaginary tree in his strange and ancient language? When I was little, there was a first discover and the, the imaginary theory. Uh, what came to my mind was the image of a dense forest, not a hap not a huge tree. After going through so many things, I still find it hard to believe that the foundation of the universe is a giant tree that nature countless light live selfishly and voluntarily. I prefer to see each planet as a seed carried by the wind that happened to land on this soil, the seed that began uh, to take root and grow bigger, eventually farming the uh, ha ha. The universe isn't concerned with our present, it's merely assist and observe. Man, today is not a good day to be philosophical. I cannot fucking understand half the word they are saying. So I need to... I should actually go up here. Perfect. 
effects, so we just go here and right on the end. Oh my god, is that scroller? Finally found you. We haven't seen Angela for years. Dr. Cherry, please forgive me for not telling you that I feel sorry for your plight. I know you have long seen it coming. I brought this upon myself. After all these years, I no longer have to remind of that. I need help, Dr. Zerum. I can tell you are driven to the corner as you are still willing to talk to me after going through all those hardships. Planet Zerum can be your temporary shelter if you need. No, no way. I pledge to myself never to involve in any more innocent people in the midst. No matter where I hide, the IBC will find me. It's just a matter of time. I can't be on the run forever, so I need to fight back in some way. I heard that a genius had developed a secret drug capable of blocking part of their consciousness and memory of a person. I've never been close uh, with anyone from the genius already, so I need you to pull the string for me. The celebrity blocking agent, I heard of it. I suppose uh, it's the brainchild of the electric pharmacist. Indeed, that lady had no dealing with the IBC, so the risk of her selling you out is low. Question Do you think? Uh, this is a surefire solution. All I'm certain is that it has the smallest price to pay. Uh, as long as I can forget the knowledge temporarily, the IBC will have no means to extract it from my brain. As for whatever I'm going through, I deserve it. Everyone must be accountable for the action, and facing the consequences is part of, uh, part and parcel of the process. I don't say I may give you drugs. You find it honest with yourself, doctor. I'm glad for you for the achievement alone. alone. I hope with all my heart that you can pull through this tough time. Also, did I just... Because I, maybe I glanced by his past it. The fucker just detonated a bomb and killed like a billion people or something. <laughs> this is the second time someone just fucking throw a bomb at someone. Um, just want to investigate. What's that? Just want to investigate. I you! Okay, I guess I can do that. Dr. Chadwick is in front of you in an advanced age. He looked very similar to how he was when we first met him. He still had those competent eyes, now tingled with a hint of gloominess. He can't seem to sense your presence, perhaps you can take a look around the room first. Okay. Something in a kid. The desk before you, the old man is stacked with unsent letters. Uh, on a cover letter written by uh, in hasty, hasty handwriting, an authorized send request, return recommend. One wonders what's inside the safe on the wall. It could be completely empty because the counter camera right here has no mean, no more secret you can hide. A few books are scattered on the floor. You peer at the name, and suddenly they have nothing to do with chat with specialization nor research subject. You find it hard to believe that the old man will be interested in Zenzo Vera folk music theory, or perhaps he must have lived here for too long. Okay, let's check where it is under house arrest. Can you feel me? Ah, did they send their guys over again? Who is sent here? Make no difference. I said time and time again, I'm no longer to uh no longer of use to you guys. You block the thing. How do you know? Ah, I get it. This is a reality, and you're an an IPC RK, are you? Wonderful. It's been so long since I had normal connection with someone. I don't need anything here as they'll get me whatever I want. I just deprive of freedom. At first they pretended to be friendly with me. They tem tempered me with valuable and promised in return for my knowledge and all to avail. Eventually they lost their patience and started forcing me to read articles related to the theories of imaginary application. But the drugs Our drug was uh, surprisingly effective. Not only did it block my access to related knowledge in my mind, but also hampered my ability to learn the knowledge. Much later on, they accepted the fact that I have been reduced to a useless old man. Starting from some point in time, they changed their strategy and decided to just wait for my death. You don't have to. It's a price I have to pay. The passing of time and the increasing pain seems to have elevated my guilt, which is the only good thing about being confined here. 
I'll gather bits and pieces of info from the people they send me. Combined with my own deduction, I believe the IBC might be skimming a to temper with the memor memory left in my brain after the death of my physical body. They probably think that no matter how tight lived I am now, whatever remain of my dead body will be at their disposal. I'm scared, youngster. I'm worried that all the precautions I've taken so far will be naked upon my demise. At this rate, the IBC one day, uh, will one day regain control of the emergency post technology and mobilize it. My effort will all be in vain at the times come. About that, Doctor, your effort is at rate. Here we are again, Doctor Chadwick. Scroll up, and I thought I could see you again. I once thought so too. Life is unpredictable, but it will eventually show us the villainous side. I'm here to tell you that your offense is in vain. Even after the death of your physical body, you're still safeguarding your knowledge, leaving no chance for those harboring ulterior motive. It isn't the effect, effect of the drug, but the ingrained dedication and preservation in your consciousness. Sorry, it could be better. You know what, Scrollum? You always regarded uh, not listening to the voice inside me when we first met. It's just a simple phrase, but I haven't seen, I haven't been able to say it. Probably time I hear it myself now. Say, so, wait, life is fleeting, and many reach the end with regret. I can't say your life is a happy one, but it at least complete when this moment takes place. I joined the experience not for a good cause, but for myself. I wanted to, I wanted my talents and expertise to be seen for the whole world, and that's it. Thank you, scholar, and you. I feel much better, probably never better. You've been through a lot, Dr. Chai. Wait, now, if you don't mind, please let us uh, be with you as you make your way to the end. Holy shit, this is... Still not done. What the fuck? I thought it's done. Um. Okay. No, he's standing. No way. Please tell me, how did... Hey, okay. I have not gathered too many questions at this minute. Whatever there's one lady has that I believe will come on the best on our behalf. In a short few years, salary salary achieved up. Why the fuck you do that? I can't read at a fucking like a speed of light. <laughs> oh my god, this is like the worst kind of escort mission. Okay. Let's wake up, Miss Yarados. That's a uh, they miss a spacing there. And essentially, a straight up bug. Whoa. Thank you, Miss Yarados. You managed to unravel the mysteries surrounding Doctor Chadwick and give him freedom. I I literally did nothing. <laughs> I literally did nothing. You were the first person that was both willing and able to help him. That alone was plenty. I found a way to convince the family to bring the remnant of Chadwick's memory to the special attention. As the witness to the complication of his life, I would have to invite you to play pay your friend rest should you wish to, that is. Sure. I shall wait to your seclusion zone. So, if I'm not fucking remembering wrong, because holy shit, this, qu this is the longest fucking quest I swear I have been in. Not in terms of like actual length, it's the amount of fucking re uh, like just a word. 90% of this is just word. My brain is like shut down at some point. I'm like, oh my god, they just non stop talking. <laughs> There's like uh, differences with talking to be engaged and just talking. And it's like, I don't get it. They're talking science stuff. And I hate listening to science. <laughs> so yeah, I'm not miss so it's okay. Let me get it let me get the details correct, okay? Just uh for my sake. So this Chadwick is a is a smart guy, got recruited by uh got recruited in the junior society uh and learn the formula of the fucking thing of Bob, right? Um join the IPC or something at some point I like maybe make an agreement with them. Um his buddy Dubli was like hmm let's test it out shall we and it's like oh sure why not what's the worst that could happen? Oh whoops beep 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 kaboom everything dies uh, 
now the IPC is like, oh my god, what the fuck was that? Oh wow, that is that strong? Mmm, actually. And so they wanted to eat. Um, then obviously Chad was like, no, no one can have this. No one should need this. And so uh, asked Scrollum for help to know any way to block memory. Scrollum say, I know, I have connection. <laughs> I have a connection. I know a guy, and uh, chuck him in Panacone, and actually no. Why? Yeah, he chuck him in Panacone, so Scrollum should know it's the Panacone, no? Oh, he just gave him the drug. He only just gave him the drug, and then he just wandered here by himself, drink the drug, and then enter the dreamscape. Probably the case. Most likely. Um, or some, maybe, I don't know. But then, um, his body somehow become in the IPC. The IPC, sorry, the Pentagonis, um, hotel. And his body is gone. But at least he doesn't reveal yet. So it's like the Bloodhound family is protecting the body from the IPC uh, And yeah, I think that's most likely the case Ooh. Okay, we Madam Yarados To invest error later, Dr. Chow is finally freed He is now with us What Dr. Chow with this Treated uh, uh, the most become reality After he dismissed the IPC has treated the memories in his brain With the advanced technology provided by the Garden of Recognition as seal in a memory bubble They must prepare Oh never mind So they didn't protect it They just They sent him to it Because they, he actually did die And therefore Just fucking Gloop Into a fucking bubble They prepare for it in advance As the process I What the fuck I did press it By accident They must have prepared for it in advance as the process took place right after his death so fast that even his conscience in his final mode were preserved. That step alone wasn't enough as the brother preserved that that way was in essence a straight tangent pool. It was remained inactive for too long a time what was in the water would eventually die out. Therefore the IPC came up with a solution sending Chadwick to Vanguard to maintain the activity of a memorial uh, speculation that technology development must have struck some sort of deal with the family. Under the family supposition, Dr. Chadwick wanted to redeem skate of Toto Tamara if one for you, Mr. Rider. Any news? So what now? It's time for the to rest. This is such a miracle, it's hard to believe he managed to resist the IPC until now, with uh, what little consciousness remaining in his memorial. I was right about him back then. He has always been a genius, but he isn't always that determined. Science and technology is not good or evil. For the past hundred of years, he's been trying to redeem himself for a thought uh, he had when he was young. When Yarodos told me about him, I thought I had finally have a chance to learn about his research. Definitely the thing turned out this way. Those devices are used to maintain the vitality of memory bubble temporarily. By turning them off, Dr. Shell will be able to enter a peaceful slumber. Dr. Yarodos, let's pay our final respect to him together. We're just gonna kill him. <laughs> I'm sorry. You're just saying, ah, sh yeah, just you know, kill him. It's just that's, that's a that's a normal response, no? Just just fucking murder him. Just let let's let's. let's just... <laughs> ah, it's more what, a lifelong machine in bondsman that could our children check with existence. Hello? You hope for a response from a word to the departure of his brilliant mind. Yet all the linger is profound silence in that. I don't I don't know you very well, Doctor. We've known each other for a century yet you only met three times. Now let's play on me to address you as friend. Oh wow, I need to do it one by one. Oh, oh this is horrible! Oh, I don't like this part. Oh, 
Why the fuck do we have to manually one by one like strip him away? Why my collision research had potential to save billions of lives. Regardless, the error has slipped through our finger like sand prior to the onset of an actual disaster. All we can do is pray. Pray that it is the discerning gaze of Nels may turn towards the next consonant chat week. Oh my god! Why you have to make me do this one by one? This is horrendous. Should I also say something? <coughs> Dr. Uh, Chadwick, although I've never met you in person, I really admire your intelligent research. You know, I don't actually give compliments, but our field of study shares many commonalities. Your work on the theory of managing implication has sparked my inspiration on more than just one occasion, and I have to say, it's even made me <coughs> a tad jealous. It's a shame that we've never met a chance uh, to work together. From what I have heard from the screwly and that troublemaker, you had your shares of hardship in your lifetime. Rest in peace, Doc. Oh, this is... Oh, it's, it's... My hand feel wrong. <laughs> it feel icky. Is this over? Uh, it's in a calm conclusion for Dr. Sheffield in his later year, this will count as a significant luxury. On the image, I'll be bidding farewell to a fellow society member in person. It feel rather particular. It's a real pity if only I had realized two and by error earlier. Madam Hota, Madam Hota. Is it, do you hear that voice just now? Are you just playing a prank? Oh no, both of you, I heard their voice too. Maybe the residual consciousness on Dr. Chadwick. Please come closer. Seven again, but this time it seems quieter. Dr. Chadwick himself, when still linger faintly, is making an eager effort to communicate with us. Get closer. Ah, nah, uh, no, I, I don't like this part at all. <coughs> I don't hurt that. I'm listening, Doctor. If there's anything else you want to say, now is the time. I'm honored. Uh, my research, my knowledge, I will leave behind. Please accept. Wait, what are you saying? Memory is dissipating. Please come closer. Touch forehead. I understand, Doctor. The whole pressing of forehead against the terrible bubble, the memory bubble is still tracing your travel consciousness. I cannot read that in time. Oh shit! You can now read. You can actually read that here now. I didn't know you can do that. Chalos Chadwick. There's nothing more than an ordinary person with a lifespan with just a few decades. Yeah, he managed to achieve such an um, astonishing feat. Am I? I suppose you could say that, but to be honest, I'm somewhat envious, a bit jealous. At that very moment, he entrusted me with all his life work. It appeared that in his final moment of his life, General Yu chose to place his truck in you, Madam Hota, even though the two of you had never met before. The reason behind organic life is truly unpredictable. Nevertheless, the impulse of organic life frequently employs a guard and romantic poetry that never fails to leave me is all. Remember, it's truly remarkable. Tens of thousands of formula and equations are flashing through my mind right now. I never imagined that could be a way to analyze the problem. From imaginary overflow and uh, to imaginary, imaginary implosion. From theory to application. From a mere paper to the birth of imaginary pulse. Ah. What do you see, Madam Hota? I saw the final word be left behind. To Madam Hopta, where I held my position during my lifetime, given the resource, the IPC processes, they will inevitably discover the mean and technique to reproduce the imaginary impulse pause. To die was cast at the moment the imaginary pause was created. Every corner of the universe is destined to be on guard against its threat. I can turn back time. I can't turn back time, but there's one still one thing I can do. I can entrust my knowledge and technology to those who are worthy, thereby establish the groundwork for a deterrence system robust enough to counter the IPC might. My life is nearly its conclusion, yet from this moment onward, I aspire to be an unyielding blade eternally poised from Trinity and Melons. Holy shit! That is the... <laughs> that is the craziest ending to uh, the... Like, the most like... I would say man, a boring ass a uh, quest. <laughs> that quest is a snooze fest. So I'm like, <sighs> okay, okay. Mainly because it's like the the story is so similar to all other quests uh, in Pentagoni. Like, oh, this guy is dying. Uh this guy was evil. He turned good, but memory loss. You recover memory, conscious uh, uh, recover. Now you make the et uh, uh, ethical dilemma whether you want them to, uh, to continue or you uh, uh, make them 
uh, pay their sin or whatever, not what, what, what for, what not, right? You want to rescue them or not? It's, you know, I'm like, okay, I feel like I sensed this before. It is a different twist on making it so that it's like a fucking the researcher side of a uh, instead of like a fucking politician or uh, about fucking marriage issue. It's just a very smart guy uh, doing very smart things. Uh, get caught up by his smartness and has nearly doomed the world if he didn't protect it quite literally I think he literally doomed the world um, the ending oh just this whole sequence in this area is oh god oh the 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 fact that I have to manually just, just close it's like man, imagine manually <laughs> like and I, 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 I don't have this experience because I didn't do this but I just like to assume, like, imagine someone's on their deathbed, right? They live a long life and it's like, um, they are ready to, to, to go, right? So, you can just, I, I think it's like most common de- depiction, you just, you unplug their life support and that's it. Wow, so peaceful, <laughs> so peaceful. <laughs> the way they do it, is fucking, <laughs> the life support connect to three fucking outlets. You have to manually unplug one. Then you hear the person uh, uh, the, uh, that, that you're unplugging for just slowly whiff away uh, half their life like Ugh. Then you have to crawl or like shimmy through across the room. Unplug the second one. Then you're gonna hear them again. Ugh. Then lastly you run all the way to the corner back and then just unplug the third one. Then you finally hear them ah peacefully pass away. It's like no, what the fuck? That's horrendous. Oh god. Oh, why the fuck you make me do that? Uh. I do like the the ending part where uh, Herta has been uh, has been like absorb uh, his knowledge because I think knowledge what make a human being what call a human human. Like what make us individually uh, unique so one would argue that say as long as your knowledge exists you're technically still there if you i mean your knowledge is like you still can think and come up with new stuff and whatnot right and can process new stuff um in his bowel state he still can do that um though it's you know limited but knowing that he is going to go, uh, him leaving he, all his work to Herta is a really, I don't know, it's a very sweet move. I really like that. That's good. That's a, that's a very good move. After like horrendously butchering someone slowly. Oh god, my hand feels so dirty. Oh, I wish to never experience that again. Oh. Other than that, um... Is a good quest question mark? <laughs> like I, I, I just like the ending <laughs> The middle part again if I was like Maybe I can I don't know I, I don't know I don't know I was asleep halfway through the quest not really, but I was like in and out. Like my consciousness is like in and out of the dream skate and to reality. But I kinda understand what they're trying to go for. I understand the end of the story. That's you know that's probably all it matters. <laughs> you you learn the 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 moral of the story. Uh, fuck IPC. <laughs> that's the moral of the story. Fuck IPC and fuck Aventurine. Uh, with that. Thanks so much for watching. What an odd, what an odd one. I hope you have a great rest of the day, and I will see you tomorrow. Usual. Bye, yo.